okay so in question number 3 so first one is from matrix chapter and second is from probability and this third is uh, trigonometry so let us solve one by one first let us take this matrix if you multiply this both and plus 2 into x x is a matrix is equals to 1 minus 5 minus 4 6 we need to find out the matrix x so everything is 2 by 2 order then x value of matrix x also is a 2 by 2 order okay let me take this uh, given equation and let us solve so the given matrix is 3 7 and 2 4 3 7 2 4 This should be multiplied with 0, 2, 5, 3. That plus 2 into matrix X. So result is 1 minus 5 minus 4 and 6. So matrix multiplication is first two matrix. That is uh, this first row and first column. And first second row, second column. First second row again, first column, second column. So you know matrix multiplications, we will solve that. First row, first column, again first row, second column. Again second row, first and second row, second. So if you multiply, the result is 3 into 0, 0, 7, 5 is 35. So 0 plus 35. Again first row, second column. Okay, 3, 2 is a 6 plus 3, 7 is a 21. Now first row is over. Now again it's second row, first column. Okay, 2, 0, 0 plus 4, 5 is a 20. Again, 2 to the 4, second row, second column, and 12. Okay. This is a 2 by 2 order. Plus 2 into matrix X, that is equals to 1 minus 5 minus 4, 6. Just to simplify now. If you simplify this both, 35. Otherwise, you okay, can simplify this. So, 35, 27, 20 and 16 right plus 2 into matrix x is equals to 1 minus 5 minus 4 6 now except for 2x this matrix take other side then you'll get 2 into matrix x is equals to here is 1 minus 5 minus 4 6 and this that matrix completely i take other side right side that is minus 35 27 20 16 this is subtraction of these two matrix 1 minus 35 okay, that is uh, minus 34 and minus 5 minus 27 okay minus 32 and minus 4 minus 20 is minus 24 6 minus 16 is minus 10 then that is the 2 into x matrix so if you want a matrix x divide by 2 each and every element because already 2 in x, right? So every element you should divide by 2. That is minus 34 by 2, minus 32 divided by 2, minus 24 by 2, and minus 10 by 2. That is the final answer. So matrix of x is equal to 30, minus 34 by 2 is minus 17, and it's minus 16, minus 12, because minus 24 by 2, and it's minus 5. This is the required uh, matrix x value. Let's see the next one. The second is this is from probability a die is rolled. So generally you have the die are six numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's a sample space. If the outcome is an even number, and what is the probability that is a prime? So even prime probability. And second is if the outcome is prime number, and what is the probability of odd? So odd prime probability you should find out. So let us take this value, third B. So random experiment is a die is rolled. A die is rolled. Then sample space. So this is should I clearly sample space is that is yes. So take uh, when the die is rolled, sample space is one, two, three, four, five, six. Only six numbers. Therefore, N of yes is equal to 6 number of elements then if you see the event so first one is the prime number that is even prime let's take a 
even prime so from this even prime number c is the event 1 then in this even prime number is only 2 then n of e1 is equals to oh sorry only 1 not 2 because only one element that is number 1 then we can find out the probability so required probability is equals to n of e1 by n of s so favorable by possible that is 1 by 6 and second is I'm taking b here is the odd prime so condition is odd prime number if you take it as event 2 so an odd prime numbers from 1 to 6 is only 3 and 5 okay then n of e2 is equals to 2 then required probability so in this probability is the n of e2 so number of favorable by all the possible outcomes n of s that is equals to 2 by 6 which cancel to 1s are 2 3s are so 1 by 3 is the required probability of getting odd prime number 1 by 3 right so this is about this simple question and let us see next one yeah. this is trigonometry we will take LHS sin a minus tan a by uh, sorry say k minus tan a by say k plus tan a is equals to 1 plus 2 tan square a minus 2 sec k tan a so let's take the LHS and we'll prove this RHS. So I'll show you. So LHS is sec k. So in this LHS left hand side uh, which is given is sec k minus tan a. Sec k minus uh, tan a and divide by sec k plus tan a this is the given values LHS now if you observe the RHS so 2 tan square a so squares are there then you can multiply both numerator and denominator by sec k minus tan a because some squares we need to get the a plus b whole square or a minus b whole square just to multiply both multiply both numerator and denominator by sec k minus tan a to get the output so multiply both numerator and denominator so both numerator and denominator so this also numerator and denominator by sec k minus tan a because you will get a minus b whole square and a square minus b square formulas and some cancellations so further you should take this step so when you apply this then the change just not playing sec k minus tan a by sec k plus tan a so this is given this both numerator and denominator you should multiply with sec k minus tan a sec k minus tan a into same sec k minus tan a then this will be change top numerator is a minus b into a minus b so a minus b whole square formula that is sec a minus tan a whole square denominator is a plus b into a minus b formula okay this is uh, tan a sec a minus uh, tan a a plus b into a minus b so that is a square minus b square so that is a sec square a minus tan square a now just to apply a minus b whole square formula in numerator will get the answer rhs that is a minus b whole square is a square plus b square minus 2ab right so sec square a plus tan square a minus 2ab so 2 into sec k into tan a by sec square a minus tan square is 1 that's it again sec square a is 1 plus tan square a so this is 1 plus tan square a plus again this uh, tan square a is asked is minus 2 sec a and tan a 
Now, according to the RHS, 1 plus tan A plus tan A. Tan square A plus tan square A is 2 tan square A minus 2 sec A into tan A is as it is. So, this only is the RHS. So, what we need to prove? This is 1 plus 2 tan square A minus 2 sec A tan A. Right? This is RHS. So, LHS we are taken by applying rules. We got the RHS hence true. Yes. yes. So, you can solve this problems in this way. Now, let us see question number 4 and we will solve this. Solve all these problems.